I'm working out here in the bee yard today, taking a little break. I saw these things sitting here and <clears throat> I've mentioned them in my videos. So I thought I would just do a quick video or show you how they work. My aim is to possibly save you some money and aggravation. Money and aggravation, money I've wasted, aggravation I've experienced. These are frame grabbers. Now this style here, you can see, okay, sorry the floor squeaks in my building here. This is a kind of a terrible unit. These little springs fall off all the time. The one on this side is gone. Very difficult to avoid those little springs falling off. And I actually found that handle, it's so small, one year I grabbed that so hard that I broke a, a nerve in my thumb and my thumb was numb for most of the season. So don't buy that one. This one I bought, <clears throat> thought it looked really good. It's a Walter T. Kelly. It's got a nice wide uh, grip on it. Uh, I liked it because it had a wider, it had a wider handle. Uh, so I wouldn't cut that uh, nerve when gri gripping it tightly. Well, I used it about twice and then the spring in the middle fell out. It's nowhere to be seen. So that's kind of a waste of money too. And that's, I think, the most expensive of the three. The one I like the best is has wooden handles. So the wooden handle is a little larger so it doesn't uh, doesn't hurt my fingers if I grip too tightly. I pull a heavy frame or something with with a, a lifter and I maybe get overzealous with how tightly I grip it. I don't want to drop it. This one is nice. The, the, the grippers on it are, are fairly uh, uh, fairly sharp actually. They, they sort of dig into the wood a little bit. The springs are made in such a way that they can't fall out. So definitely if you're looking for a gripper uh, the new one you get won't be all dirty like this, but if you're looking for a gripper, uh, I certainly suggest this one over the others. I think this is made in China. Not a big proponent of always buying cheap things. I buy things that work. And I don't care where it's made. I prefer that it's made domestically. Canada, number one. USA, number two. But... Uh, with the other ones, wherever they happen to be made, I don't feel that they're uh, a good use of your money uh, because they just don't perform. This I've used way more than the other two, never had a problem, and I really like that unit. Um, one thing about the wooden handles, I tend to leave my tools out in the apiary on the beehives. Convenient when I go to use things, they're right there. Uh, kind of bad because there's you know a number of beehives and maybe I don't remember which one it's on But with the wooden handles you want to keep that indoors out of the rain out of the sun They'll likely deteriorate pretty fast if you don't uh, So anyway, that's frame grippers, and that's my recommendation